All right, ma'am, can you tell me about what happened? Well, we was on the bus coming home, going home from work, and we hit Burger King. I think the bus driver might have had a heart attack. I'm not really sure. Don't quote me on it. Mm -hmm. You know? The, um, but we can survived. Can you tell me it. about when did you see the start? Him, uh, he was starting to lose control. Did you see any of that, any signs prior to the crash happening? Well, it started speeding up. That's all I can say. The bus started speeding up quick. You have to think quick on your feet. And before I knew it, we was in Burger King. That's How hard was the impact? Oh, it was hard. It was very hard. How many people were on the bus? Just us. We was the last two on the bus before this turn over here. You and that uh, lady over there? Yes. Okay. Hey, can you tell me about the impact? Uh, what happened? What did you do? How did you react when that bus hit? Once we hit, once we hit Burger King, I got out my seat and I immediately went to him to try to help him out. He was moaning, he was saying whatever. I started CPR on him. So he His wasn't other breathing. Other guy came on, came on. He was moaning and then he passed out on me, but he still had a pulse. Oh, okay. And you he said you, you said Another you started CPR after yes. you felt the pulse. Yes, I started before I felt the pulse. Another man came on the bus with me, he had on pink shorts or something. I don't know who he is, he opened up the doors or whatever. He could have been an MTA rider, I don't know. Mm -hmm. And he took over. The and then CPR? I just went and sat down. You mentioned he took over the CPR? Yes. Oh, okay. He took this, over. I was on the bus with 911. Now this is after you felt the pulse? Yes, he actually felt the pulse. Oh, okay. Because I was feeling his arms, but he felt it on his neck, so. Okay. Yeah. And uh, at what point did EMS arrive, fire department, oh, how quickly they did they show quick. up? quick. Immediately, I was on with 911. Next thing I heard the ambulance, the siren, the fire trucks. They just came and started pulling shit apart. You know how the fire department mm -hmm. did. She was okay. Now we saw she some of the uh, tire tracks in the grass. Uh, did you feel the bus yes, drive we on the swerving. grass? We swerved everywhere. Wow. We swerved, we was coming around. I think he was actually looking for a place to hit. Uh, That's my opinion. Because we was coming down Dark Street, and next thing I know, we just went into Burger King. I said, oh, he hit something. I didn't even know it was Burger King until a man outside told me. But I said, it's a restaurant. I was telling the ambulance people, I mean the EMS people, 911 people. 
that it's an M, a restaurant because I've seen the tables and everything. I said it could be Burger King because I know Burger King is on our turn, but then i seen the gas station on K in the Metro, whatever that is. You know if any pedestrians were struck on the sidewalk or anything like that? Not that I know of. No. Not that I know of. And uh, when EMS showed up, did they continue CPR? Did they rush him to the hospital? No, they took him right out the bus and he was gone. Okay. They took him off. I don't know anything else. And, and how are you doing, ma'am? So far, I'm great. I can't complain. I survived the crash. It could have been a whole lot worse. But for right now, I'm okay. What I feel like tomorrow or the next day or the week coming, who knows? You know. And Once you were, you were checked out by and EMS and all that. Down. I was checked out by yes, EMS. It's good to hear that you're okay, man. Yeah. You didn't hit the bus or anything in the bus when it crashed. Only thing I hit was my knees because I was holding on. Oh, okay. The seat in front of me, I was hitting that. That's it. But far as I know, I'm okay. It's good to hear, man. Yeah. What's your name? I'm Valerie. Can you spell it? V a l o r i. -E. Thanks T -E -R -E -R. again. Man. Appreciate it. You're welcome. Take. Alright, tell me about this scene here. What happened? I mean, you could clearly see it looks pretty bad. Uh, it's not something you run into every day, a bus inside Burger King. It's obviously sad. This is like a staple in our neighbor neighborhood. One of the few fast food restaurants in our neighborhood that we go to. Not much around here. So it's sad that we're not going to, um, for the meantime, not have this no longer. Yeah. Ever seen anything like this before? Absolutely not. I don't, I have never seen anything like this and hopefully I never do see anything like this. It's a pretty dangerous scene. It looks pretty bad. I hope everyone's safe that was involved. But yeah, it looks really bad. Yeah. How far is the bus inside of that restaurant? It looks a few feet. Like maybe five feet inside, five to ten feet. But like when I first came up and I saw the scene, I just thought it hit like maybe the edge of the building. But like when I came around the corner and just saw it in actually inside of Burger King, that's not something you really see. It looks absolutely awful, yeah. And um you know, when you showed up, were you trying to eat at the restaurant or did you hear I mean, about it? It's usually clo close around this time. It closes like 9 o'clock, 10 o'clock around that time. We're just going for a late night walk. You know, we usually we, we walk. It's a safe neighborhood. Nothing really happens around here. Walking around the neighborhood, um, you know, it's a nice walk. And then, you know, just seeing scenes like this, you know, let's, you know, the danger of it is pretty awful. You know, to be thinking that you could just walk down a block and then a, an MTA bus could just, you know, run into you at any second. It's pretty dangerous. It makes you think. It's really bad, yeah. Thanks a lot, man. No problem. Uh, no what's problem. your name? Omar. Omar. Can you spell it? O M A R. Thanks again, man. No problem. No problem. Yeah. When you guys came upon this, you guys didn't get a crash. You just saw all the lights. No, we just saw. Yeah, we just saw like a big, a big scene. And then obviously, when you see all these lights flashing, it catches your attention. You know, and the first thing you think about is something catastrophic, which is not, you know, it's the worst thing you can think of. But that's just naturally what you think of. And then hopefully everyone's safe. That's just the first thing. Everyone's safe. Everyone's all right. No one's dead. But yeah, that's, you know, we saw a big scene here. And yeah, we just see, a, you know, a bus inside Burger King. That's what we really see, yeah. Thank you. No problem. No problem. Thank, Thank you. you very much. Thank you very much.